y'all, it's Zachary. Welcome to Burn Down's Country Kitchen. This afternoon, ish, 11.37, we're getting there. It's almost noon, dang on it. Um, I'm gonna get after me a nice dip. It's a hot day, or a nice cool dip. It just sounds really good with some chips, uh, or heck, even crackers, Ritz, whatever. Um, it is, we're gonna go ahead and make a fried dill pickle dip. Man, does that not sound good? Fried dill, pickled it. All right, y'all, before we get started, like, share, subscribe, it does me a lot of good. The, the likes and the shares uh, help me catch that algorithm. I uh, appreciate that, and the views help me out tremendously as well. So, all right, let's get after these ingredients. All right, y'all, got my panko. I'm also have a little bit of butter, a couple of tablespoons. I'm just gonna fry this up a little bit, uh, just to brown it. I'm gonna have uh, one tablespoon of Worcestershire sauce, Worcestershire, sh this stuff. I'm gonna have one tablespoon of onion powder and garlic powder. I'm gonna have two tablespoons of ranch seasoning, uh, which I haven't pulled out of the cabinet yet, but we will get to that. One 16 ounce tub of sour cream, one eight ounce block softened of cream cheese, and some pickle spears. That'd be about it, y'all. You can also get you some fresh dill to chop up and put in there if you want. Uh, I chose not to do that. I got enough dill. I'm good. Oh, all right, y'all. It's enough the ingredients. Let's get to the food. Get you your eight ounce softened cream cheese. 16 ounces of sour cream. Should be quick and easy, y'all. Quick and easy. All right. Two tablespoons ranch seasoning. One tablespoon of onion powder. Garlic powder. We'll do our Worcestershire sauce as well. There we go. It's about a tablespoon. We'll give this a quick mix. Kind of get everything incorporated. Doesn't have to be great because we still got to add pickles and stuff, but we want to start to get that cream cheese moving. Okay, on low heat, go ahead and melt some butter. We're going to throw in some panko. Go ahead and cook that until it browns up a little bit. All right, this is browned up nicely. About done. I just turn the heat off. Doesn't take long at all. A few minutes on a low heat. That's all you need. Just want to toast it up a little bit. Get these pickles cut up here. Probably gonna do four. I'm gonna start with three just to see. Yeah, we'll do four. We'll do four. Start there. How about that? You want these pretty small? That'd be big. If you're a background noise, uh, that is an air conditioner. Let me tell you, it's hot today, which is nice because I am so tired of that rain. All right. Get these in here. To stir in. Yeah, four seems to be a good number. Man. Y'all love fried pickles. This is supposed to remind you of that. So I've never made it before, but it looked good when I came across it. Oh, it was in a short, man, I wish I could remember who I got it from, but just in a short. 
All right. And we're gonna take our, most of them, not all of them. We wanna save some. Get this in here. Maybe save about a quarter of it. We'll get that in there too, huh? It looks so good, y'all. Kind of can't wait to taste it. Love me a good dip in the summertime. I've been waiting on summer, y'all, and I'm not really a summer guy. I'm just not. Of course, I lost all the weight. Now I'm no longer a winter guy either, so I am a spring and fall guy. <laughs> All of a sudden. All right, so that's done. And we'll take the rest of this. Put it on the top. Now, it doesn't have to be the rest of it. You just want to cover the top of it. Looks good, doesn't it? All right. Let me get you another dill here. Stick that right on in there. All right, y'all, that's done, which means it is officially that time again. Like, share, subscribe. Like I said in the beginning of the show, it does help me out a lot. Uh, and, the, and the likes and the shares do as well as the views. So, all right, y'all, enough of the business. Let's get to the food. Can y'all see it? No, you can't, come on. Nice, right? Let's give a bite, huh? Alright, fried dill pickle dip. Oh, that's good. Mmm, that's good. Put some on my pickle here. Mm. Mm. That's really good. And a little messy, which means we did it right. All right, y'all. This is my snack. I'm gonna get after this. Um, man, I hope you liked it. Make something, make anything. Make a fried dill pickle dip. Why not, right? Kind of a mouthful. Fried dill pickle dip. The only thing we fry is the breadcrumbs. Uh, but man, it was really good. It tastes a lot like a fried pickle, but you know, with the sour cream, cream cheese and stuff added. All right, y'all. Again, hope you liked it. Till next time.